Hey, this is Phil. I'm uh, making a short video to show you how I loop the GAN i3. So smart cubes have electronic components inside of them, so it's best not to loop them too much. Uh, you run the risk of damaging the components if you put in too much at once. So the strategy here will be to put in little by little and break it in. So what we'll do is lubical speedy. We'll apply a very little bit of it, and then we'll start scrambling it and breaking it in. Great. So once you feel like the lube is broken in and working well for you, you can add a little bit more. Right. And at this point, I would say the cube is fairly thoroughly lubed. If you want to add more, you can. Uh, you have to be careful with water-based lube when you lube smart cubes, because if too much, then it's not good for the cube. But you can totally apply one drop and immediately break it in on the pieces. That's completely fine. No problems. And now uh, I've lubed the cube. And it feels good. Hmm. Cool. And of course, with the GAN i3, you can adjust the magnets and everything else on the cube. So if you like the cube to feel in a different way, you can totally do that. Anyways, hope it helps. Uh, I think the number one thing to remember is to lube it little by little and not dump too much of it at once. That way you can protect the electronics. All right? See ya.